In this part 2 of 3, I'll be showing you guys how to screen record, edit, and export a video. Before we begin guys, make sure you hit the subscribe button with the notification bell on so you don't miss another future video if you're interested in videos on Nintendo Switch and Minecraft. Hey guys, it's Starcats and welcome back to part 2. I'll show you guys how to screen record with OBS and how to edit with iMovie. However, even if I am using iMovie, you should still be able to follow along because this is just a basic editing tutorial. I'll try and make it as universal as possible. Um, however, if you want to get more advanced into your editing software, whether you're using like something like Filmora or Final Cut, uh, just search up something for you on Google or YouTube and you'll find some good tutorials on it. Anyways, uh, let's just begin. So first we're gonna start off by screen recording. To do that, uh, press, I'm just in OBS, so just install OBS, it shouldn't be hard. And here you can see this, and if I turn off display capture you won't see it anymore. However, what you put is you're gonna press display capture, and you can name this something like monitor if you want. Um, you're gonna press OK. Now it's pretty unnecessary to have another one because I already have um, it on. However, you know it's, it's there. However, um, I'm gonna delete this because I don't need it. Just just showing you how to add it. I also need a scene. However, I couldn't do it because I'm screen recording with OBS, as you can see from like the audio bars. Uh, anyways, before you actually record, you need to go to settings and output is where you're going to be actually recording videos. Now, you can change the video bitrate like that. Now, what I would suggest doing is you want to choose your destination. I do desktop, which is why you see it recording over there. However, uh, I would also recommend changing the format. I do MP4 because I don't want to have to convert it every time to make it go into iMovie because iMovie doesn't support MKV or whatever. So that's why I do MP4. And it says recording saved to MP4 will be unrecoverable if the file be finalized. Um, this should really never really occur. I never had it occur, however, I mean, I guess it could. Um, so you can just change those settings. And we're basically done with OBS. You can hit the start uh, recording button. I'm already having it like recording, so I'll s I have a stop recording. However, you kind of get how it works. Um, so yeah, that's how OBS works. So I'm just gonna close out of here because I already have like maybe some sample footage. Now you're gonna go open iMovie or whatever the editing software is that you have. I just personally use iMovie because I think it's awesome. Okay, so what you do, once you open up iMovie, is you'll see a create new button. Press that and hit movie, uh, combine videos, photos, and music to make your own new movie. Now this is only just a basic editing tutorial, so you won't see any like some crazy advanced techniques. However, um, this is should be good to start off your channel. So first thing you want to do is you want to import media. So there's kind of like two ways of doing that. You can either press the import media button here or the arrow up here or you can drag and drop. I like to import media. So let's do that. So I have like these. I'll show you how to do it green screen just I guess while we're here. Um, and let's also look for something. Um, uh, I guess I'll do this one. I think it's just the edited one, but it's fine. We'll just like edit it again. So now um, I have like your footage. Uh, this is edited, however, I will still use it. So here, this slider is to make it uh, more workable, I guess. 
Now, the first thing you want to do with your edited footage, footage is you want to clip out any parts that maybe the viewers don't really care about or you're not talking in it so they don't really care. So, for example, I'm just going to take out my intro. And to do that, you're going to right click and you're going to press split clip. And you're going to scroll to where you want to keep your footage again. Probably right here. Split the clip. And you can press delete. Alternatively, you can just like split a clip here and you can just drag I'm gonna put the audio down so it doesn't mess up and you can just keep doing that until like all the parts are and I would say stuff like when you're not talking or you're in a really boring part of the game um, try and keep it as interesting as possible and the second thing I'll show you guys, like kind of minimum thing, is how to import music and that I can just drag and drop. So music, I'll show you how to add layers in a second. Yep, this music is good. I get my music from the NCS channel. Um, and some other YouTube channels as well that provide royalty free music. Don't ever have copyright music because that's not good. Um, always have royalty free music. Now what you can do is I'm just going to adjust the slider and let's listen to that. Always make sure that if, if you can't like if you have to like raise the volume up just to hear you or you have to put on captions to hear to know what you're saying that probably means your music is way too high you should always have it like like not like maybe this small but hearable but not like it's overdoing your voice yeah you can kind of hear it but you could probably hear me however there's music in this video as well so I don't want to mess that up and so that's basically that so now um, what you gonna do is you're gonna press the export button for your software it'll depend however for iMovie it is this button here and don't do it to YouTube because file would be better quality and you can make it 1080p if it supports it you can make it better quality and like well, not custom, like, best pro. I wouldn't recommend that. Just, I put it at high and faster. Um, you can name it. I recommend naming it. So I'll just put this as example. And you're going to press next. And you can save it to your desktop or to a certain file. Now, I don't want to actually export this because I'm not even going to, I'm not going to do anything with it. However, that's basically how you export it anyways guys i think that about wraps up the video this was kind of like just the bare minimums basic guide to getting started because this kind of varies to what software you have and i tried to make it as universal as possible um however if i did do a decent job at that a like would be appreciated and if and subscribing would make you support the channel for videos like Super Smash Bros Ultimate, Minecraft, Zelda, and hopefully more Pokemon in the future, maybe more games in the future. So make sure you subscribe if you're interested in that. And guys, I'll just see you guys next time. Goodbye.